So if you're like me, you may be extremely indecisive and when making decisions in games, it may be a little bit difficult for you when choosing what game to play. You may have a hard time and you may be arguing with your friends for about an hour, but you can do some really awesome things with polls that will allow your viewers to help you with these kinds of things. Hey, what's up everybody, Kadak here, and today we're gonna to go over how to use polls on your Twitch channel, how to set them up, and some ideas of things that you can use polls for. Now, personally, I typically use polls to allow people to choose what game I'm gonna play, um, but you can use them for a whole number of things like choosing a map, choosing a character to play, choosing what your next stream will be about. Um, really, the possibilities are endless. So let's quickly go over how to set up a poll. So to start a poll, let's go ahead and head over to our dashboard. We're gonna go and go to the creator dashboard. And to start a poll, you're gonna to wanna to do it from the quick actions or you can do it from the chat. I'm gonna show you to do it from the quick actions first. So go ahead and if you don't see it here as a button, click the little plus icon and we're gonna find manage a poll. We're gonna add that. So now if you click this, you're gonna see poll management and this was the last poll that I had, which is what game we should play. You can view the results about it, right? Battlefield, Battlefront, SnowRunner, so on and so forth. You can create it as a browser source. You can add this directly into OBS, which is really nice. Um, you can see the vote breakdown. People can use channel points to contribute more, and I'll show you about that in a second. But let's go ahead and create a new poll. So let's say, what should my next video focus on we'll say twitch computers games hardware dance video all right so those are my options you have a minimum of two options obviously and you can allow additional vo votes by allowing people to use your channel points or by using bits so I don't want people to have to pay bits to use additional votes. Um, so I usually have that one turned off, but if you wanna use more channel points and vote more times, you can go ahead and do that. It'll be an extra 200 channel points. Now you can set the duration. The minimum is one minute and the maximum is, is 10 minutes. When you go ahead and you start a poll, you'll see in the chat, it'll pop up and you'll be able to, people will be able to choose an option as a viewer and they'll vote and then the numbers will appear here and if people want to use more they can use channel points and vote more than once so now let me go ahead and show you how to do a poll within your chat without having to use the quick action button so let's go ahead and end this current poll twitch was the winner there and now let's go ahead and create a new poll so you do slash poll and it'll open up a menu to create the poll. So it's the same thing as pressing the button, but this one will always create a new poll for you. So if you wanna use it that way, you can go ahead and do that. So as I mentioned, polls are just a really simple way to have some interaction with your chat, allow them to have some influence over what you're doing. And if you're really indecisive, like I am, it really allows them to make some choices onto things they wanna watch. Because for me, streaming is just a lot of fun and I really do enjoy you know, playing the games that people enjoy watching, but I also enjoy playing. So I can list out a bunch of games that I think I would enjoy and allow people to choose the game that they think they would enjoy watching. So that's it. Again, super simple. Hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, really appreciate it. If you like, subscribed. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback, feel free to leave those down below. I try to get to them all as quickly as possible. And all of those things combined really do help me with the YouTube algorithm. So I do appreciate them very much. As always, I stream on Twitch from Friday until Tuesday. Come check me out and say hello. If you have any questions, you're more than welcome to ask me there as well, and I'll try to answer them as quickly as I can. Thanks again for watching the end of the video. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you next Friday.